Today's training, we're taking a look at three of the beginner drills for Espada Idaga. If you're just starting off in this area of Kali, which is the third area of Kali, then make sure you're beginning with these drills. It's gonna help enhance your coordination and get you started on the right page. Our first drill that's up, we're gonna strike our one and our two. We call that the angle one, angle two. It's just gonna make a big X in front of the body. And then we're gonna thrust the dagger out, thrust out the knife. We have one, two, thrust. One, two, thrust, just like that. Start nice and slow, and then as you're getting more familiar with the movements, gradually speed it up. Make it smooth, slow, smooth, equals smooth, fast. Then you can always work on adding in more power. That's our first drill. The second drill for our basic espadilla dagas, this is the passing daga. So from here, we're gonna strike an angle one with the long weapon, then we're gonna thrust through with the short weapon. So now you're gonna see that my stick is underneath my left armpit. Then I'm gonna strike my angle two, and then I'm gonna come out either with that jabbing type of strike or with a thrust. So you can play around with both of those. Let's take a look at it from this side. I'm gonna strike my angle one, my dagger or my knife hand, look how high it goes, to the top of my head. I'm gonna thrust it through, this crosses or passes the daga over. I'm gonna strike that number two and then thrust out with the dagger. So we have one, two, three, four movements for drill number two. Again, start slow, gradually build up the smoothness. Then, once you have it smooth, then start working on speed. Okay. Once you got that speed, it's nice and smooth, then you can start to work in more power. Make sure to check out our online school to further your Kali training with us here at Kali Center. We'd love to coach you and help you advance in your Kali skills. You can also head over to our gear shop over at KaliCenter.com if you need to purchase any Kali sticks, training knives, or any gear for your Kali training. I have the links down in the description below. For the third perfect beginner drill on Espada Daga, this is the simultaneous Espada and Daga striking. So pay close attention to this one because sometimes it can kind of be a little bit tricky if this is brand new to you. So from here, we're gonna strike our angle one just like this. Now look at what I do with my dagger hand. Okay, you can't just keep it right here in the middle because you're gonna end up running it into yourself. So it has to move from your plexus down to your left hip. Now, as we come back around with the angle two, I'm going to thrust the dagger at the exact same time. As I finish the follow through of my angle two, my dagger is gonna circle underneath and then it's gonna go right back into that thrust. And we're gonna bring it right back. Okay, let me show you that from here, from the straight on view. So we have our angle one. Notice that that daga slides to the left hip. See, it disappeared from my opponent's eyes. It's easy to forget about the daga. As I strike my angle two, I come out with the thrust at the same time. As my two crosses the center line, my dagger comes underneath like a little circle, and then I'm going to thrust it out just like that. And then it comes back and it starts all over. We have one, two, three movements. One, two, three movements. Okay. Again, start it off nice and slow and gradually work on smoothening these movements before you're adding in power. Okay. Get it smooth. Then gradually increase the speed. Then you can add in some more power. Do not neglect this area of Kali. So many people are like, they kind of frown upon this one because they don't understand it or it's not as flashy and as cool as like the double sticks or they think it's not as practical as learning like single knife or empty hands, but you're gaining so much coordination. You're learning so many different ways to manipulate your body and your weapons that will then translate to the other weapons, including your empty hand skills. 
so don't neglect the Espada Yadaga. If you're new to the channel, make sure to hit the thumbs up button for Espada Yadaga. Leave me a comment below, which is your favorite area of Kali? Are you a single stick, double stick, Espada Yadaga, knife guy, double knife, empty hands? Maybe uh, list down uh, in the order your top five and subscribe to the channel. It's always great to have some new viewers because 75% of our viewers are not subscribed. Come on, it's free. Just click the button right now and I'll catch you back here for some more Kali training. Kali fun, all right? Bah. Bah.